how do we have our youth relate to the ancient scriptures? I would love some tips. You guys are the experts on this. Or something. <laughs> <laughs> to you, I would say, I actually think the themes of Isaiah can speak directly to youth. And like to people in high school in particular, for me, high school is an evil regime. That's my silly way of saying that I, I do think that there are messages in Isaiah that can help us cope with some of the most challenging things of life. Death of a loved one, mental illness, um, uh, watching a family member suffer. I think it's all there in Isaiah. I think one challenge is the language. You know, this is a, a 17, early 17th century translation that we tend to read and which we should continue to read in our church meetings, right? But in our church handbook, it, it emphasizes that while in church meetings we should read the King James Version collectively as a church in individual devotional reading, we should bring in as many other resources as will bless us. So I, to those students, I would say, we need to get you a second translation because English has moved since 1711 or 1611, right? It's, it's shifted. And so letting them read Isaiah in a way that an ancient Israelite more analogously would have heard Isaiah, meaning in language that they can understand, I think that can go a long way because then you know what he's saying and now it's, okay, so what's the principle here? How does this relate to the fact that I'm losing my mom? Or how does this relate to the fact that I am lonely every day at school? And I think, the, I think there are jewels in there okay. that we can find if, if we can just help them read the language.